Hey guys, I'm back. I recently was sent a PR box from CoverGirl. This look will be done with everything from CoverGirl. I use no other products besides what was sent in the box. So getting right into the look, I always start with the eyes first. It's just easier in case I have any fallout. I am priming my lid with the lid lockup. Then I'm going in with the Katie Cat palette, Katy Perry by CoverGirl. And you'll see, I show you what color I'm using on my lid. Oh, sorry, I started with the transition color. Then I go in to that kind of pinky rose gold for the lid color. Deepen that crease, highlight the brow bone. And now for the brows, I went in with this dip kind of pomade. I was pleasantly surprised by this. It went on pretty smoothly. And then once I brushed it out with the spoolie, I only used the spoolie on the pencil brow that was provided just to kind of even out what the pomade did and make it look a little bit more natural. Then from there, I went in with the Vitalist Go Glow Luminizing Lotion. During the summer, during the hotter months, I don't really like to use foundation. I try to stick to tinted moisturizers, more lightweight stuff rather than having heavy liquid foundation on. It's just that feeling of my face melting off is not cute. The only thing I do wish is that this had SPF in it, but you know, beggars can't be choosy. Went in with concealer, blend that in with my beauty blender. My beauty blender is the only non cover girl <laughs> item used. Well, actually, let me stop lying. The brushes that I use throughout the video aren't cover girl either, but you get the point. After I blend that in, then I went in with the Vitalist Healthy Glow Highlighter Illuminator in, I guess this is a shade three. Put a little bit on my finger and brushed it in or rubbed it in as you see there. Then I set my face with this powder, the Vitalis Healthy Powder in shade 745 Warm Beige. Then we go ahead and lock the look up with that setting spray. This was the most fun part to me. I'm actually digging these color liquid liners that they have here. So I did my signature or usual winged liner in this sort of emerald green color. Finally, I finished off the look with this Peacock Flare Mascara. I think that's black that I went in there. Oh no, I lied. The lipstick is last. And I went in with the Katy Perry Lip Gloss in the shade Pounce. This was a different look for me. I'm usually a liquid matte girl, but I wanted to try something new. So I went ahead and used a gloss. I was pretty pleased with the finished product. Like I said, not my usual full foundation, full coverage look. Definitely like the lightweight feeling and you can sort of see my skin through the moisturizer. The concealer is a little bit ashy, but I can work with it. Tone it down a little bit with the setting powder and I'm good to go. So like I said, this entire look was done with CoverGirl products. I haven't even made a dent into the box that they gave me, but I will have some fun with this this summer. And thanks to CoverGirl for sending these products. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Thank you.